Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x square plus 3x over x plus 3 bracket square is equal to 40. To find the values of x from this equation. Now, solution. From our problem, which is this here, x square plus into here, this square will take in the numerator and in the denominator. So it will be 3x bracket square. So here, 3x bracket square over, we will take this square in the denominator. So it will be x plus 3 bracket square is equal to this 40. Then it will be x square plus here. 3x bracket square, so 3 square, it is 9x square. Then over this here, x plus 3 bracket square is equal to 40. Then this x square is same as x square over 1. So the LCM of 1 and x plus 3 bracket square, it is this here. So here over x plus 3 bracket square so x plus 3 bracket square divided by 1 it is this this here times x square here it will be x square then bracket this here x plus 3 bracket square then plus x plus 3 bracket square divided by x plus 3 bracket square it is 1 1 times 9 x square here it is 9 x square then is equal to this 40 then in the next step it will be x square we expand this x plus 3 bracket square so here to be bracket x square then plus 2 times x times 3 is 6 x plus 3 square it is 9 bracket then plus this 9 x square over this here x plus 3 bracket square is equal to 40 then in the next step we'll take this x square times x square it is x power of 4 plus x square times 6x it is 6x power of 3 plus x square times 9 is 9x square plus this 9x square then over this here x plus 3 bracket square is equal to 40 then in the next step it will be x power of 4 plus 6x power of 3 plus 9x square plus 9x square it is 18x square then over this here x plus 3 bracket square is equal to 40 then in the next step it will be this here which is x power of 4 plus from here 6x power of 3 plus 18x square 6x square is common so we'll take 6x square out of bracket then 6x power of 3 divided by 6x square here it is x plus 18x square divided by 6x square here it is 3 bracket then over this x plus 3 bracket square is equal to 40 then in the next step we'll divide by this x plus 3 x square in this part and in this part so it will be this over this so x power of 4 over this x plus 3 bracket square then plus this over this 6 x square bracket x plus 3 bracket over this x plus 3 bracket square is equal to 40 then in the next step 
here we will simplify x plus 3 here x plus 3 bracket square so this will cancel this so it will be x power of 4 over x plus 3 bracket square then plus this here 6 x square over x plus 3 is equal to 40 then in the next step here square and this will make 12 square so x power 4 is same as x square bracket square then over x plus 3 bracket square then plus into here we'll take 6 out of bracket so it will be 6 out of bracket this here x square over this x plus 3 bracket is equal to 40 then from here square is common so we'll take square out of bracket so it will be this over this so x square over x plus 3 bracket this square which is common then plus 6 bracket x square over x plus 3 bracket is equal to 40 now from this here inside the bracket it is common x square of x plus 3 x square of x plus 3 so we will let let's say u is equal to x square over x plus 3 so it will be here this it will be u square so u square plus 6u so 6u is equal to 40 then we'll take 40 to the left side so it will be u square plus 6u this take to this side to be minus 40 is equal to 0 then from this quadratic equation it can be solved by grouping and factorization whereas the product is equal to coefficient of u square is 1 1 times negative 40 product is negative 40 and sum is equal to coefficient of u which is 6 so here this <coughs> negative 40 and 6 negative 40 is a product of 10 10 times negative 4 10 times negative 4 is negative 40 and 6 is the sum of 10 plus negative 4 or 10 minus 4 it is 6 so to get this 6u 6u is equal to we use these factors 6u is equal to 10 u minus 4u is 6u so into here we substitute 6u we substitute this here so it will be u square plus 6u is same as plus this here 10 u minus 4u minus 40 is equal to 0 then from here u is common so we'll take u out of bracket 6u divided by u I mean u square divided by u it is u plus 10u divided by u it is 10 bracket then into here negative 4 is common we'll take out of bracket negative 4u divided by negative 4 it is u negative 40 divided by negative 4 here it is 10 so plus 10 bracket is equal to 0 then from here 10 u plus 10 is common so we'll take u plus 10 bracket out of bracket this divided by u plus 10 it is u negative 4 times u plus 10 divided by u plus 10 it is this negative 4 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions where this first solution of u plus 10 is equal to 0 and this second solution of u minus 4 is equal to 0 then from this solution here we we'll take 10 to the right side so it will be u is equal to negative 10 
and here we take negative 4 to the right side to be u is equal to 4 but we recall before we let u is equal to this here x square over x plus 3 so x square over x plus 3 then from here we have two solutions whereas u is this x square plus x plus 3 is equal to negative 10 so x square over x plus 3 is equal to this negative 10 and we have this solution here u u is equal to 4 so we substitute the u which is x square over x plus 3 is equal to this 4 then in the next step from here into this first solution here this is same as over 1 so we'll cross multiply so x square times 1 here it is x square is equal to x plus 3 times negative 10 so here to be negative 10 bracket x plus 3 bracket then it will be x square is equal to negative 10 times x is negative 10 x negative 10 times 3 is negative 30 so it will be x square we we'll take negative 10 to this side so it will here to be plus here this will take here to be plus 10 x negative 30 will take this side to plus 30 is equal to 0 then from this quadratic equation we will solve by using quadratic formula so from quadratic formula to find the values of x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a so it will be x is equal to negative b b is 10 so negative 10 plus or minus square root of b square it will be 10 square minus 4 times a it is 1 times c is 30 then over 2 times a it is 1 then in the next step it will be x is equal to negative 10 plus or minus square root of 10 square is 100 minus 4 times 30 here it is minus 120 then over 2 times 1 it is 2 so it will be x is equal to minus 10 plus or minus square root of 100 minus 120 here it is minus 20 then over 2 so it will be x is equal to minus 10 plus or minus square root of minus 20 minus 20 is same as 4 times 5 times negative 1 then over 2 so it will be x is equal to minus 10 plus or minus square root of 4 it is 2 square root of negative 1 it is i times this square root of 5 then over 2 so it will be x is equal to here divide by 2 we'll divide by 2 in this part and this part so it will be this over this so minus 10 over 2 plus or minus this over this 2i square root of 5 over 2 so it will be x is equal to minus 10 divided by 2 here it is minus 5 then plus or minus 2i divided by 2 here it will be i this square root of 5 so into here we have two complex solutions for the values of x now to solve from this second solution here this 4 is same as 4 over 1 then we cross multiply so x square times 1 it is x square is equal to 4 times this here so 4 bracket x plus 3 bracket then it will be x square is equal to 4 times x here is 4 x plus 4 times 3 it is 
12. Then it will be x square 4x to take this side to be minus 4x. 12 to take this side minus 12 is equal to 0. Now from this quadratic equation, this it can be solved by grouping and factorization because the product here, product, product is coefficient of x squared is 1. 1 times negative 12 is negative 12. And sum is coefficient of x which is negative 4. So negative 12 is the product of negative 6 times 2. And here negative 4 is the sum of negative 6 plus 2. 2 minus 6 is negative 4. So this negative 4x, negative 4x is is split by use by is splitted by using these two factors. So here it will be negative 6x plus 2x. So here it will be x square minus 4x is same as 6x plus 2x, which is same as 2x minus 6x. So here to be plus 2x minus 6x is negative 6x then minus 12 is equal to 0 so into here x is common so we take x out of bracket x squared divided by x is x plus 2x divided by x is 2 bracket here negative 6 is common we take negative 6 out of bracket Negative 6x divided by negative 6 is x. Negative 12 divided by negative 6 here is 2. So plus 2 bracket is equal to 0. Then here x plus 2 is common. So we take x plus 2 bracket out of bracket. x times x plus 2 divided by x plus 2. It is x. Negative 6 times x plus 2 divided by x plus 2. It is negative 6 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions where this first solution of x plus 2 is equal to 0 and this second solution of x minus 6 is equal to 0 so from this solution here we take 2 to the right side so it will be x is equal to negative 2 and here we take negative 6 to the right side to be x is equal to 6 so from here we have two solutions which are real solutions. Therefore, our conclusion, the first value of x is equal to this 6. The second value of x is equal to negative 2. The third value of x is equal to, these are real solutions. Now from, from this complex solution, it will be negative 5 plus i is equal to 5. So negative 5 plus i square root of 5 and the fourth value of x is equal to negative 5 minus i square root of 5 so negative 5 minus i square root of 5 so these are all the values of x in this our problem two real solutions and two complex solutions Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.